Um, CVS. CVS was my biggest haul today, and um, I'm going to showcase Nasalese and Simulsan, because, Simulasan, <laughs> whatever it is, um, because they just, it was like a fantastic deal. Um, I did 11 transactions. Most of them ended up being like um, 28 cents, 28 cents. Um, 85 cents, you know, some of them ended up being 22 cents, even I had like three transactions that were, or two transactions that were 10 cents, um, I know you guys are going to say, oh my god, the candy, the candy was my filler, um, I know that we have all that overage, and I have tons of coupons left, we didn't get them here in Massachusetts, so all the stores are super stocked, I went to one, two, three Walgreens to get all this, I think I said I was going to start with CVS. I meant to say Walgreens. Um, it's been a long day. Um, and just they were all stocked. I didn't want to clear any shelves. And a lot of people are getting other things like fillers. I'm, I need milk and stuff like that, and I'm going to get them later. But I'm super stockpiled on paper towels, so I didn't really need paper towels, but I thought I'd throw one in there. I have a stockpile of it in the garage. Um, but candy can always go over well with the kids in the nursing classes. I have a, a big group of kids that I sit with that are, we're all cool, and I try to bring in candy or things for them. You know, the younger you are, the better your metabolism is, so they really love it. I call it coupon day, and they, they super love it. So I'll buy this stuff. These are on clearance for $0.19, cents. so not only were they a great filler, but um, Everybody loves M&M's. People were buying regular M&M's at the register, and I was like, you know those are 19 cents over in the <laughs> candy aisle. But I guess people didn't realize that there were M&M's there. I probably got, gosh, I don't even know. There's probably 40 or so there. I'm not going to go through my receipts because everybody knows what the deal is. You buy one of these, it gives you a $6 register reward. You buy the other one, it gives you a $9 register reward. And with the coupons, you have a $5 overage on one, and then you have a... Um, two dollar overage on the other roughly and you just keep rolling them back and forth so I got eleven of the nasal ease and similar and whatever's um, probably about forty of these these were some of my other filler items these are on clearance um, like one of my god kids it's kinda cool you push it and as long as it stays on that's for as long as you're supposed to tell the child to brush so it's got a little one minute timer which I thought was kinda cool for a buck and then these were on clearance for fourteen cents I can use these in school a little 25 cents support the cure bracelet candy three bags of these I ended up getting a Scott's and then I had that this this dollar fifty but it wasn't um shop it wasn't shop right it was um Walgreens one that was giving out if you've been on tiny chat you know my big thing is um, laundry detergent so these were um, the buy one get one free at Walgreens so these were my highest transactions on my receipts these ended up Making it a dollar fifty-eight out of pocket for one, two, three transactions, or dollar, dollar and change. I added up all my receipts. I didn't. It was seven dollars and eighty cents I spent today, just out of pocket. But I still have a nine-dollar registry reward. So technically, I got all this for free, in my opinion. So um, you know the deal with the the kids' toothpaste. It's a dollar off with the coupon in the red plum, and then a dollar off from the booklet, making these totally free. So I had um, three, four, I had eleven coupons. So I got eleven of those. These were one of my fillers on when the we were doing the extra four fifty on the from the nasalies rolling to the simul, simul whatever it is. God, the simul, simulasin, simulasin, yeah. So these were my ten cents transactions. These are on clearance. It's twenty two loads. It's those you know you throw in the sheet. It's got the detergent in it, the softener, and it, you carry it over, and it's the in the dryer, it's the dryer sheet too, all in one. So I got two of those. Um, what else did I get? That, the paper towels, and all that. So that was seven bucks and eighty cents, I think, was my total out of Walgreens and a nine dollar register reward in pocket. So totally free. I went in with six dollars in register rewards. So nothing really out of pocket to start the transactions, and nothing. Um, I got my nine dollars back, or the seven fifty that I spent on that. Uh, for ShopRite, um, because of the coding error we, that was posted on Living Rich with Coupons before we knew it was an error, these were ringing up for $1.40. Hopefully other people still got the deal or, or ran out and grabbed it. And we had that dollar off of one L'Oreal um, skincare product. So I got four of these Age Perfect Cream Cleansers. 
I got three of the Revitalift cream cleansers, and then I got six of the wipes. And um, just so you know, we had that $5 off Zantax coupon in the 4-1 Smart Source, if you got it in your region. And then ShopRite has a $3 e-coupon that you can load to your card. So as soon as you scan your card and this item, it takes $3 off. Use the $5 off coupon, and then you end up getting... Um, I think it's seven forty nine. I think you get a fifty cents overage. Let me see. Yeah, so here's the set it's seven fifty nine. The e coupon for three dollars, and then there's the five dollars. So you got the overage on that. So here's my um totals. This was um uh, four sixty eight because I got four of them. I think I got six, yeah. And I used four one dollar off coupons. This one was eighty four cents. And then this one was a dollar seventy. So, um, and then I got um, fifteen dollars back in cash. I thought it was twenty, but I only did three transactions. So I paid five dollars and change by fifty, and I got fifteen dollars back towards my groceries next visit. So that was a fantastic deal. So I hope some people get um, to do that. Um, I did the Greg that dude. If you don't know Greg that dude dot com, Greg that dude on YouTube. I followed his scenario for the most part on. The spend twenty and get um, get a free whisk. Um, this ended up costing me eight dollars out of pocket, going in with ten dollars in, in um, extra care bucks. But um, I screwed up. I made like a, a rookie mistake on this alloy. So I'm gonna take this back. This is eight bucks. So technically, this transaction would have been free. Um, and the only thing that's missing in this transaction is that I have. Two, um, I got two of those crystal lights, but um, $6.99, $6.99, $6.99, a dollar off each, making them $5.99. Um, I had a $2 off whisk coupon. Um, I had a $4 off alloy coupon. And then I had a $4 off of 20 register reward um, coupon, a 20% off coupon, and I had a um, $10 in, in extra care bucks. So as soon as I take this alloy away, this should be zero out of pocket. Um, and we have tons of toilet paper, but with three guys in the house, it goes super fast. So that was actually a fantastic deal. I'm definitely going to take that alloy if I can. I don't know where I put the receipt, so I better find it because I want to return that. And then the last deal I did was my Target haul. I did um, six more of the $1.78 light bulbs, and he actually gave me the overage. So he gave me um, the 22 cents per times six, so that I made a dollar something there. This was the 99 cents. I made a penny on that because of the dollar off Target coupon. And uh, my best friend called me today about these here. This is the Food Saver um, Fresh Saver, which basically seals in the food into the packets. It's the handheld one. These are 19.94. There's a $10 off Target coupon, and then there's a $10 off printable. And if you look on Living Rich with Coupons, that's actually on, on the website. I'll try to post everything that I remember on my blog. And then this transaction was $8. This was totally free over here with Overage. And then this was the only thing that actually fit the device. They, they ran out of the um, bags that you're supposed to use. So this was um, $9. Uh, yeah, $9.99. And because of the, you know, the, the, couple pennies over here, the dollar something over here, the penny here. This ended up being like, my total was eight sixty five, I think. Um, and then tax, so nine twenty altogether. Which isn't bad because this is twenty twenty and then two dollars each or whatever they were before they were on sale. Six dollars each. So six times six is thirty six. So you're talking about, you know, eighty, ninety dollars worth of stuff for nine nine bucks. Um and you can never have enough light bulbs. I uh, have a stack of them over there with stuff I haven't put away yet either still. So yeah, that's my haul. And I still have tons of the Nasalese and um, Simulacin coupons. So I'm just going to keep rolling it all week. I still need milk and a bunch of other stuff and more laundry detergent. My goal on laundry detergent is to get up to 100. I have like 60-something in my stockpile. But people keep coming over, you know, if you're if I if they're like super family, they can have some of my laundry detergent. But generally I don't give any of it away. So yeah, I, I for the people who are in ShopRite, this is a great deal to get it for free. 
Um, I don't know how many times you can load that e-coupon or how many times it works, but it's my first time doing an e-coupon. I know I'm not a rookie, but I don't. There's a lot of things that I don't do, and e-coupons. This is my first time with e-coupons, but I officially love e-coupons as of today. Um, this was a great deal. I don't really know how it worked out to be zero once I return that alloway. I know that it'll it'll definitely be a zero out of pocket, but I don't really know how that worked out. <laughs> I'm gonna have to do the math when I hang when I hang this up. But this haul right here was like great. I mean, the first. Walgreens I went into, they only had the, the nasalies, so I, I did the first nasalies transaction, and just, I said, all right, I'll just leave with that. Um, oh, I'm sorry, I did the nasalies and five, and five of these? Yeah, five of these. So, um, that was the first transaction. Then the next Walgreens, two of my favorite, well, actually three of my favorite cashiers were there, and the evil old lady wasn't there, and they said, come over to, to the beauty, and we'll, I said, well, I'm going to do like six transactions or or five if that's all right and they said yeah just every time you just let us know so i gave each of them like 10 coupons five of the simul simulacin and five of the nasalies i'm going to laugh at myself for saying that wrong so many times in this video so they were super ecstatic because they can run the deal themselves throughout the week but they were just so accommodating i didn't even have to empty out my carriage they didn't care they're like we trust you blah 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 it was just easy, but the evil old lady came in, and she was going to be working the health beauty, and on my last transaction, I saw her, and they're like, you're not coming over to beauty? I was like, hell no. She's working over there, and I see her coming. I said, I'm going to go to the front register to the young guy who, he's always like, oh, big spender, 22 cents, you know, so super smooth day, and then I went over to the urban area, and this uh, little Puerto Rican girl was working the counter, and she was, every time I went up, she's like, 10 cents? 10 cents and I'm like yep so I gave her some coupons I tell you if you have extra coupons and if you ever want to I, I mean for me in my area teaching somebody about a deal that they can do and giving them a handful of coupons is just like the best thing you could ever do even CVS it was super easy even though some of the coupons didn't work on the Ajax coupon wouldn't work on the Ajax um at CVS, the Ajax coupon didn't work on the Ajax dish detergent for some reason, even though it says any product from Ajax. But And then even the, the ShopRite ladies, um, I gave them a couple coupons because the shelves still had like 10, 15 of them left. Um, the only place I didn't, the cashier was just all right, was the um, Target. He forced all my coupons in for the overage, which was great, but he just wasn't really super chatty. So... This video is the longest video I think I've made because I've been babbling. But, peace, deuces.